Hello everyone and welcome back to Dragon Age Origins. We need to level some peeps up. Alright, so she gets Dex, Cunning, and Con. We have more archery. Blood and damnation. Indeed. Yes. See, did they ding? Sten dinged. Calm, calm your tit, Sten. Strength, con, and dex. Bravery for sure. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Shit. Well, I guess we can't level them up yet. That's fine. Dex is fine, girl. And we'll uh, use the dog whistle. Awesome. I know dog needs to level up. Let me draw a. Apparently we well we apparently we can't change the Francis Cow will take that. Oh wait, that I like that. The libertarian's cow, I know I like that. Yes, I do. I remember enjoying that. I shall do it. Dragons. These are the first dragons we have encountered in the Dragon Age. I shall do it. Ooh. Oh, wow, I like that. Oh yeah, that's way better. Bar war harness. That is just all around better. There's nothing about that that isn't better. Because those guys explode. Everyone good? 
Everybody good. With the exception of perhaps Alistair. Allow me. I could do that for you. I don't think you have sufficient skill either. Right. Yeah, so you shut the fuck up. We must come back here when we got all when we um, upgrade our shit. Sweet. Beastman's dagger is that better than what I've got? Uh, yeah, it is. Nice. Thing, I got a lot of gifts down here. Got a lot of stuff that I can be selling, but we're not really uh, in a position to sell things at the moment. Uh, this is an ambush room. Very well. Yep. Sorry, Alistair. Good job, Alistair. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, thank you, Win. Some wind leveled up too. Allow me. I could do that for you. Liliana, you don't have the skill either. You shut the fuck up. Alright, Alistair definitely needs the strength and the con. And we'll give him the dex as well. Don't go out, cleanse aura. And shield. Oh, yeah, let's give him overpower. You definitely need willpower, magic, and con. Got revival, that's good, that's what we need. Um, arcane shield. This trick again? I know what you are. It won't work. I will stay strong. Are you all right? The boy is exhausted. And this cage, I, I've never seen anything like it. Rest easy. Help is here. Uh, enough visions. If anything in you is human, uh, kill me now and stop this game. He's delirious. He's been tortured. And I've probably been denied food and water. I can tell. Here, I have a skin of. Don't touch me. Stay away. Filthy blood mages, getting in my head. Ah, uh, I will not break. I'd rather die. Where are the other survivors? What others? What are you talking about? Irving and the other mages who fought Aldred. Where are they? They are in the harrowing chamber. The sounds coming up from there. Oh, Maker. We must hurry. They are in grave danger, I am sure of it. You can't save them! You don't know what they've become. I don't understand. What are you afraid of? They've been surrounded by, by blood mages whose wicked fingers snake into your mind and corrupt your thoughts. His hatred of mages is so intense. The memory of his friend's deaths is still fresh in his mind. You have to end it now, before it's too late. I want to save everyone who can possibly be saved. Are you really saving anyone by taking this risk? To ensure this horror, 
is ended. To guarantee that no abominations or blood mages live, you must kill everyone up there. I cannot decide on that before seeing what's going on. That is your choice to make, but I beg you to consider what I have to say. You cannot tell Maleficarum by sight. Just one could influence the mind of a king, of a grand cleric. I do not want the blood of innocence on my hands. I am just willing to see the painful truth, which you are content to ignore. Ah, but what can I do? As you can see, I am in no position to directly influence your actions, though I would love to deal with the mages myself. Perhaps I can free you. Don't waste time on me. Deal with Aldrin, if that is what you plan to do. Once he is dead, I will be freed. Stay safe. It'll be over soon. No one ever listens. Not until it's far too late. Make her turn his gaze on you. I hope your compassion hasn't doomed us all. I need the mages, bro, Seth. I need the mages, Cullen. Not much of a gift. I mean, you're kind of hideous now. Ah, look what we have here. An intruder. I bid you welcome. Care to join in our revels? I think I'll just kill you if that's alright with you. Fight! It will just make my victory all the sweeter. Don't forget the litany. It will thwart Aldred's attempts to control the mages and win this fight for us. Oh, goodness my gracious. We gotta kill it. I'm a little bit on fire, but that's alright. Yeah, this is fine, me being all the way over here. I'm okay with this. I'm less okay with this. Are you all right? I've been better, but I am thankful to be alive. I 
suppose that is your doing, isn't it, Wynne? I wasn't alone. I had help. The Circle owes both of you a debt we will never be able to repay. Come. The Templars await. We shall let them know that the Tower is once again ours. Very well, lead on. No, I'd like to look around first. All right, but please hurry. Gregor should be informed of what happened here as soon as possible. Is there anything lootable in here? Nope, let's go. Are you ready to leave yet? Yeah. I'll need you to guide me down the stairs. Ugh, curse whoever insisted the circle be housed in a tower. Ah, uh, old men hating stairs. I love it. Moving? Make us bread. I did not expect to see you alive. It is over, Gregor. Aldred is dead. Aldred tortured these mages, hoping to break their wills and turn them into abominations. We don't know how many of them have turned. What? Don't be ridiculous. Of course he'll say that. He might be a blood mage. Don't you know what they did? I won't let this happen again. I am the Knight Commander here, not you. I believe order has been restored to the Circle. We will rebuild. The Circle will go on. And we will learn from this tragedy. And be strengthened by it. We have won back the Tower. I will accept Irving's assurance that all is well. But they may have demons within them, lying dormant, lying in wait. Enough. I have already made my decision. Thank you. You have proven yourself a friend of both the Circle and the Templars. And what about the Darkspawn? I require aid. I promised you aid. But with the Circle restored, my duty is to watch the mages. They are free to help you, however. Speak to them. You mean the First Enchanter? Yes, Irving. For now, I will have to oversee a sweep of the tower. There may be some survivors, and we should do our best to tend to them. Please excuse me. And Irving, it is good to have you back. Ah, I'm sure we'll be at each other's throats again in no time. Cool, great. Oh, that's not what I wanted to hit. Uh, Here we are. Okay. The tower in disarray. The circle merely annihilated. Though it could have been much, much worse. I am glad you arrived when you did. It's almost as though the Maker himself sent you. The Blight drove me here to seek aid. The least we can do is help you against the Darkspawn. I would hate to survive this only to be overcome by the Blight. So I have your word? You have my word. As first enchanter, the Circle will join the Grey Wardens in the fight. Irving, I have a request. I seek leave to follow the Grey Warden. Wynne, we need you here. The Circle needs you. I appreciate the sentiment, Irving. But the Circle will do fine without me. The Circle has you. This woman is brave and good and capable of great things. If she will accept my help, I will help her accomplish her goals. I would be honored to have you join me, Wynn. You were never one to stay in the tower when there was adventure to be had elsewhere. Why stay when I can be of service elsewhere? Then I give you leave to follow the Grey Warden, but know that you always have a place here. There is much to be done here, and I must go. You must forgive me for not being a proper host. Can the Circle go to Redcliffe and to save a possessed child? The child is possessed. But killing the demon would mean killing the... Unless you intend to enter the Fae. Yes. Yes, it can be done with a group of mages. I shall gather what mages I can, 
and we shall leave promptly. My life is at stake. Winner proves plus seven. All right, that's not journal. Um, watch card of the reaching. We need to do or. Yep. Uh, the blight. Alright, awesome. Um, completed quests. The blight. Broken circle. Hell yes. The blight. Um, the Arl of Cardcliff. Seek the circle's help to free Connor. All right. Yep. So we're doing that, but we need to finish off. Um. need to finish off this. Oops. So, tell me, how did you become a Grey Warden? Fuck. Uh, Arl Howe massacred my family. Duncan helped me escape. Arl Rendon Howe? The Arl of Amaranthine? Why would he do such a thing to you? Uh, who knows? He's always been a friend of us Kuzlans. You are... you are the last of the Kuzlans? I had no idea, my lady. Don't. I'm just a Grey Warden now. Yes, I suppose so. You can no longer have a title, can you? But that does not mean you must forget utterly where you came from. Take heart, dear friend. You survived even when you were not expected to. We do not know yet what lies in store for you, or the name you carry. It is not so bad, is it, being a Grey Warden? I just hope I can show, my, show the strength Duncan saw in me. Sometimes it gives me comfort to think that everything will end up the way it's supposed to, that it will be all right. You were chosen. You survived the joining when others did not. Perhaps it was meant to be. Win approves. Awesome. Oh, let's get this fuck out of here. I didn't mean to talk to Win. That was supposed to be safe for the party camp. That's alright. Kick its ass! It is helpful to do this with all the other mages here. Ooh, Verdium Chainmail. Inventory is full. That's alright, because we're heading back to the party camp. Oh, let's stop by the party camp. Alistair, yes. win. And let's do Sten. Yes. Let's go back to uh, Redcliffe Village. Actually, what is this? We are right here. Let's go there. But that's something. Okay. That's fine. I bring word, sire. There are demands from the Banor that you step down from the Regency. They are said to be gathering their forces, as are your allies. It appears it will be civil war after all, despite the dark spawn. Pity. I also have an interesting report. There seem to be Grey Wardens who survived Ostagar. How, I don't know. But they will act against you. I have arranged for a... a solution. 
with your leave. The Antivan Crows send their regards. An assassin? Against Grey Wardens, we will need the very best. <laughs> and the most expensive. Just get it done. Zevron! Zevron! I do love me some Zevron. Oh my gosh. Oh, are we, are we attacking him right now? No, we're doing uh, Dark Spawn right now. Is begun. Ooh. It shall be done. Okay, never mind then. Take the elf fruit. Kill the herlock. Or, I'm sorry, loot the herlock. Ooh, nice gold. Not bad, I'll take it. Sten needs to level up. He definitely gets strength, con. Strength and two in con, I think. Yes, much better. Uh, give him some survival. Bravery, yes. And, uh, moving on. Back to wherever, uh, Wherever that place is. Oh! <sighs> I fell. Are, are you alright? For a moment there, I thought I was... I thought it was all over. Uh, thought what was over? Everything. I... I will explain everything when we are back at camp. Now is not the time. Oh, okay. What even is this place? I'm not quite sure. Take a 
closer look at the unarmed man. You are surprised to recognize the uniform of King Kalen's honor guard. The memory comes to you. You fought alongside this man at Ostagar. Take a closer look at the guards. The guards wear the uniforms of Ban Loren, a minor lord well known and little loved for the fluidity of his allegiances. Join the fray. Ah, oh, no! Hi. That's awkward. Not Ooh, they have fire arrows. Let's heal Alistair. Up close, the man's face is unmistakable. You remember him as Elric uh, Meringue, Mar 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 a member of Caelan's honor guard at Oscar, and close confidant to the king. Thank you. I, I didn't expect the band's men to notice my escape so quickly. I tried to hide here in the woods, but there wasn't time. And now I'm a dead man. Well, you aren't dead yet. You were there in Ostagar. You know how things went. For me, it was either this, or die in some dark spawn's belly, or, or be hung as a deserter. Yes, I recognized your face. You were there with the Grey Wardens, one of Duncan's new recruits. I was to guard the King. He was my friend, understand? Make her. All that time in Ban Loren's prison. And I couldn't stop thinking about all they suffered that one dark night at Ostagar. It's not your fault they died. I know. Even had Logain's men not turned their backs on us, the Darkspawn were too many. Even Kalen, for all his bravado, knew there would be no victory at Ostagar. The king entrusted me with the key to the royal arms chest. If anything were to happen to him, he said, it was vital I deliver it to the Wardens. Is the chest important? The royal arms chest. It's where Kalen kept his father's sword. The one he always said he'd slay the archdemon with. More than that, there was a secret compartment where he kept documents concerning his dealings with Empress Selene and the Orlesians. Do you still have this key? The Maker has a sense of humor, doesn't he? I suppose it's for the best, however. Had I kept it, it would be in Van Loren's hands by now. But... You said Kaelin entrusted it to you. I was afraid. I thought I would lose it on the battlefield, so I stashed it in the camp. Please, it's probably still there. Where? The key's behind a loose stone at the base of a statue. I'll draw a map for you, so you'll know where to search. You'll be taking me along, won't you? Call me sentimental, but I left behind some dark spawn that really deserve a sword through the middle. The events at Ostagar still haunt my thoughts, Warden. If that is where we are headed, I would like to accompany you. It is vital that the King's documents do not fall into the wrong hands. As for Marek's sword, it is too powerful to be poured at by those monsters. Same for the King's other arms and armor. And... And if you happen to find Caelan's body, see it off. He was our King. He shouldn't be left to rot amidst the Darkspawn's filth. <laughs> well, that's unfortunate. I forgot some elf fruit.
All right, let's go and do um, Redcliffe Castle. Oh, we're going around that way. All right, then. Zevron? Zevron. Oh, thank the Maker. We need help. They attacked the wagon. Please help us. Follow me. I'll take you to them. Zevron! <laughs> the Grey Warden dies here. Yeah, about that. Enemies approaching. I'm stunned somehow. Do I have on any cool arrows? I don't. Let's put on some cool arrows. Like fire arrows. Detected that too late. Thanks, Win. <laughs> Guys, look there, a cunning trap. Oh, the Elven assassin is wounded and unconscious but alive. You could tie him up and talk to him if you wish. Yeah, uh, wake him up and talk to him. I have some questions. Ah, so I am to be interrogated. Let me save you some time. My name is Zebran. Zeb to my friends. I am a member of the Antiven Crows, brought here for the sole purpose of slaying any surviving Grey Wardens, which I have failed at, sadly. I'm rather happy you failed. So would I be in your shoes. For me, however, it sets a rather poor precedent, doesn't it? Getting captured by a target seems a tad detrimental to one's budding assassin career. What are the Antiven Crows? This elf is a crow. That makes sense. They are an order of assassins out of Antiva. I understand they almost run that nation, and are hired only at great expense. Quite right. I'm surprised you haven't heard much of the crows out here. Back where I come from, we're rather infamous. Not for being good assassins, I see. Oh, fine. Is that what you Fereldens do? Mock your prisoners? <laughs> Such cruelty. You came here all the way from Antiva? Not precisely. I was in the neighborhood when the offer came. The crows get around, you see. Who hired you to kill us? A rather taciturn fellow in the capital. Logan, I think his name was. Yes, that's it. Does that mean you're loyal to Logan? I have no idea what his issues are with you. The usual, I imagine. You threaten his power, yes? Beyond that, no, I am not loyal to him. I was contracted to perform a service. And now that you failed in that service? 
Oh, well, that's between Loghain and the crows, and between the crows and myself. And between you and me? Isn't that what we're establishing now? When, when were you to see him next? I wasn't. If I had succeeded, I would have returned home and the crows would have informed your Loghain of the results, if he didn't already know. If I had failed, I would be dead, or I should be, at least, as far as the crows are concerned. No need to see Loghain, then. If you had failed? What can I say, huh? I am an eternal optimist. Although the chances of succeeding at this point seem a bit slim, don't they? <laughs> no. no, I don't suppose you'd find that funny, would you? How much were you paid? I wasn't paid anything. The crows, however, were paid quite handsomely, or so I understand. Which does make me about as poor as a chantry mouse, come to think of it. Being an Antivan crow isn't for the ambitious, to be perfectly honest. Then why are you one? Well, aside from a distinct lack of ambition, I suppose it's because I wasn't given much of a choice. The crows bought me young. I was a bargain, too, or so I'm led to believe. But don't let my sad story influence you. The crows aren't so bad. They keep one well supplied. Wine, women, men, whatever you happen to fancy. Though the whole severance package is garbage, let me tell you. If you're considering joining, I'd really think twice about it. Thanks, I'll take that under advisement. You seem like a bright girl. I'm sure you have other options. Why are you telling me all this? <laughs> Why not? I wasn't paid for silence. Not that I offered it for sale, precisely. Aren't you at least loyal to your employers? Loyalty is an interesting concept. If you wish, and you're done interrogating me, we can discuss it further. I'm listening. Make it quick. Well, here's the thing. I failed to kill you, so my life is forfeit. That's how it works. If you don't kill me, the crows will. Thing is, I like living. And you obviously are the sort to give the crows pause. So let me serve you instead. Can I expect the same amount of loyalty from you? I happen to be a very loyal person. Up until the point where someone expects me to die for failing, that's not a fault, really, is it? I mean, unless you're the sort who would do the same thing. In which case, I don't come very well recommended, I suppose. I want to stop you from finishing the job later. To be completely honest, I was never given much of a choice regarding joining the Crows. They bought me on the slave market when I was a child. I think I paid my worth back to them plus tenfold. The only way out, however, is to sign up with someone they can't touch. Even if I did kill you now, they might just kill me on principle for failing the first time. Honestly, I'd rather take my chances with you. Won't they come after you? Possibly. I happen to know their wily ways, however. I can protect myself as well as you. Uh, not that you seem to need much help. And if not, well, it's not as if I had many alternatives to start with, is it? What do you want in return? Well, uh, let's see. Uh, being allowed to live would be nice, and would make me marginally more useful to you. And somewhere down the line, if you should decide that you no longer have need of me, then I go on my way. Until then, I am yours. Is that fair? Why would I want your service? Why? Because I am skilled at many things, from fighting to stealth and picking locks. <laughs> no, you're not. I could also warn you should the Antivan Crows attempt something more sophisticated now that my attempts have failed. I could also stand around and look pretty if you prefer. Warm your bed. Fend off unwanted suitors, no? Is this before or after you stab me in the back? These things you say, they must drive the men back home simply wild. So, what shall it be? I'll even shine armor. You won't find a better deal, I promise. Very well, I accept your offer. What? You're taking the assassin with us now? Does that really seem like a good idea? Don't worry about it, we could use him. Hmm. All right. Still, if there was a sign we were desperate, I think it just knocked on the door and said hello. I love Zebron. I hereby pledge my oath of loyalty to you until such a time as you choose to release me from it. I am your man, without reservation. This I swear.
Yes. Yes. Oh god fucking damn it. Oh the dog fucked it up. Yeah, yeah, Alistair disapproves, that's fine. I got a new quest, Friends of Red Jenny. Tenerum, acquired a small painted box as requested by the Friends of Red Jenny. Their reward, whatever it is, is waiting in the market district of Denerim. Hmm, so, so unfortunate that, uh... The dog fucked it up. Your desire is my command. I clicked on you by accident. Sorry, Bay. Sorry, Sten. I really had you around because I was still waiting for Zevron. Is there a way out up here? Yes, there it is. I wish I had thought to stop at that gold area. I didn't realize I'd be going around that way. It seemed like the long way around for me. Uh, no, I would like to actually go to a uh, normal Red Cliff. Are you going to let me go, or are you going to give me a random encounter for that short a distance? You're going to let me go. Good. Alright, so let's change up the party. Pick dog. Pick Morrigan. Pick Zevron. Okay, that's fine. Accept. Strength, Dex, and Con. Again, I need you to use your herbalism kit. That, yep, great. Yes. 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 Perfect. Alright, Zevron. Zevron, Zevron, Zevron. Actually, pretty well set up. Oh, Sailor's Chime, yes, take that. And Alistair, is this better than what you have? It's the same as what you have. Alright, who am I looking for with, um, uh, Knight Commander Harith? Why do I feel like it's this guy? That's be it's because it is this guy. That's why I feel like it's this guy. Move along, friend. I have a gift for you from the Mages Collective. Oh, wonderful. 
I always appreciate correspondence from my upstanding friends in the Collective. On behalf of myself and my men, I thank you. I'll make sure the Collective's generosity is reciprocated. On your way now. Return to the Mage's Collective for your reward. Well, since I'm here, I may as well. And then we'll run in and we'll do Connor. And then we'll probably call it. I don't have any more of these. Yes. Oh, yes. An urgent plea from Brother Baird. Something to stalking the wild, killing the good merchants who support the town in these difficult times. One would assume that the reason the Chantry employs the use of the Templars, but they are unmindful of a simple brother's plea. I understand they have dark spawn and the concentrate of a blah 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 blah. Kill the source. That's fine. Blackstone regulars is good. Mages Collective is like around the back here, I believe. The Mage's Collective thanks you. Make us smile upon you. Sweet. As you say. Nothing. Alright, great. Now let's run back up to the castle. Do Connor real fast. And then probably call it. Because I don't know. Uh, because I did the party camp. I don't know how long we've actually been going. For real. But it feels like a, a distance. Ugh. It's so far. It's so far. I'm close to leveling up too, looking at it. Yes. Go to right click castle. We did accomplish a lot. We really did. Uh, I would romance Zevron if my heart didn't belong to Alistair. I think I romanced him once. But I got bored and went back to Alistair. I'm very set in my romances. I don't often deviate from them. I romance somebody the first time I play it and then I'm theirs forever. That's like my real love life. There you are. Ah, there you are. We have brought Lyrium and begun preparations for the ritual. We can start any time. So only one person can go through? Yes. We haven't sufficient Lyrium at present to send more than one mage into the Fade. Are you sure this is the only way? It only works because the child gave himself to the demon willingly. If the demon takes over the host forcibly, we must slay the abomination. We have only enough lyrium for one attempt. I hope you succeed. Such a young lad deserves better than execution. Do you have any last-minute advice? 
It truly depends on the manner of demon. It sounds like a spirit of greed and desire. One of the more powerful in the hierarchy. It will likely engage you in dialogue and tempt you with an offer. Avoid it. Making deals with demons never turns out well. Let's do this now. I'm glad we decided to take this route. This is really the best option. Very well. Who will go into the Fade? When is going? Then let us begin forthwith. How exciting! We're, we just left the fade and now we're going back. Uh, this is fine. This is great. Oh, when approved. Is that you, Connor? I can hear you. I'm coming. Father, where are you? I don't understand. It's so close. You there. Have you seen my son? I can... I can hear him, but I cannot find him. This blasted fog has me turning in circles. Try to get through to the R? You are in the Fade, my lord. A demon has you trapped. You. Fade? Is, is my son in danger? He is. But I will do my best to see that all of us emerge from this unscathed. Trust me, my arm. Yes, I, I, I trust you. We must help my son. But I... I never find him in this fog. You must find Connor. Please, I beg you. Is anyone out there? Hello? Hmm. Found him. Who are you? Are you the one that made father? Tell me now. Be nice. Child, calm down. It's all right. I won't hurt you. No! You're here to hurt father. I know it. I won't let you. Connor, you have uh, changed a bit. while she's down. Oh, that one's you. Lynn is pretty quick. Oh, there you are. Why do you keep hurting me? Why are you trying to stop me? Try and communicate. Listen to me. I am just trying to help. I will not speak with you. Trespasser, I will drive you out. I've got you turned around a bit. Out. I've got a bit turned around. Nope, that's nowhere. I think I do have to go back the way I've come. I'll stop you! I will! Please forgive me. Poor Connor.
other wonders seeking me, trapped within my web. All is as it should be. Why must you interfere? He's not the entity. Because you have taken a child and trapped a good man in this place against his will. No. It is time for you to go now. Do not resist, or things will go very badly for you. Okay, this should be the last try. Let's fully heal first. Yep, that's the last one. Are you okay? Very well. No more illusions. Now we meet face to face. You see my true form and stand in my it is here I am most powerful, and yet I have no wish to engage your power, nor should you be so eager to engage mine. Perhaps we should converse instead? Sure, converse a little bit. You cannot have me. I have already been taken. One soul I already possess. I do not need another. You need not fear me on that account. I wish only to talk. There will be no discourse between us, demon. Alas, that is sad. Very well then. If you wish a battle, you will have it. Let us see if your power matches your boldness, creature. Nothing but I don't think I'm going to do, um, oof. Oh, great, that was her. got this. Ha ha. Combat training skill reduces your chance of spell failure. That's good to know, so I should train wisp uh not wisp, um win in that. Wisp is a wizard in my D and D game. Okay, so good, we did it. We finished off two branches this time. Such mad progress. Who's the funeral for? Nobody died. Oh, just all the fallen. Oh, there's a little boy. They 
they waited their sweet time. They, they took their sweet time before doing this funeral. <laughs> it's been a while since we've been back at Redcliffe. How long's it been? We did Broken Circle. It's been a, at least two party camps, so, you know, it's been a few days, at the very least. So it is over. Connor is his old self. He does not seem to remember anything, which is a blessing. I suppose we will need to send him to the Circle of Magi's Tower for training once the war is over. It's so odd to think of the boy as a mage, of all things. Eamon has much to mourn and rebuild, should he recover. But at least he could be thankful that both his son and wife are saved. I owe you my deepest thanks. I had nearly... I can scarcely believe Connor is the boy he once was. There is still the matter of Jawan. His poisoning Eamon began this whole mess, yet he lives. I must decide what becomes of him. We will hold him for Eamon to decide his fate. If he doesn't recover, Jawan's fate is sealed. What do you think? Uh, I would like him released. Released? Are you mad? Why would you do such a thing? I agree with Isolde. He's a Malefica. We cannot simply unleash him on the land and ignore his crimes. Perhaps you're right. Very well. I shall have the mage imprisoned again, for now. But our task is not done yet. Whatever the demon did to my brother, it seems to have spared his life, but he remains comatose. We cannot wake him. The urn. The urn of sacred ashes will save Eamon. The urn is a legend. It might never be found. That is a possibility. But there is a reason it's still an option. I am not simply grasping at straws. My husband funded the research of a scholar in Deneran, a brother Genetivi. He has been studying the inscriptions on Andraste's birth rock. When Eamon fell ill, I sent the knights to speak to Genitivi. I hoped that he had finally discovered the location of the urn of sacred ashes itself. They were unable to locate Genitivi. In desperation, I sent more knights in search of the brother, or some clue of the urn's location. I'll see if I can find the relic. No one else can. Even if I wish to do it myself, I cannot abandon Redcliffe to its own devices. Perhaps you could seek out the brother's home in Denerim and see if any clues remain on his whereabouts. It is the only place to begin the search, I think. I must go to the hall and begin rebuilding. I wish you luck, and may the Maker go with you. New quest, the Urn of Sacred Ash Ashes. Right, let's level us up. Let's get some more decks, and some more cunning, and some more cunning. guess we'll get this. Alright, so that is all the time I have for today. Thank you everybody so much for watching. I've been Rael, and I will see you next time. Bye! <laughs>